Texas weather expert meteorologist Jeff Jamison is out at the stockyards right now with a preview of all that fun this weekend. Jeff? Hey guys, yeah, this is such a fun place to be. Really, every day you can come down here in the stockyards and find something to do, something to entertain you, good food. And we do have the rodeo going on tonight and tomorrow night. And I want to bring in the CEO of the Cowtown Coliseum, legendary Hub Baker. Thank you, sir, so much for being here. Legendary, huh? Uh, that's right. For your legendary. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know about that. I mean, you are here, especially. You know, you got a lot going on here in the building behind me, a lot of history. Law, there's more history than you can ever learn, man. It's all the way from Enrico Caruso and opera to wrestling and boxing and uh, rodeos, the home of the world's first indoor rodeo. Uh, we now do a show called the Pony Bill Wild West Show, and I think you talked to talked to the producer this afternoon. And uh, the, tomorrow, tonight's also a fundraiser. We do a lot of fundraisers for different entities, and tonight is the Multicultural Museum uh, History and their museum, and they're raising money to do it. So we're proud to have them here. And doors open at 6:30 on the show nights, uh, 2:30 and 4:30 in the afternoons. And the one thing we really have to offer that. Is, is, is seems to be going away in the Metroplex, and that's family entertainment. Yeah. Well, that's right, and, and Hub, thank you so much for joining us, and, and a lot of people are already starting to gather here. As he mentioned, uh, 6.30 is when the gates open or the doors open for the rodeo tonight. Another one coming up tomorrow night as well, and the weather hasn't been bad this week. As you make your way out here to the stockyards, we're in the upper 80s to near 90. It, you know, this time of year it could easily be in the upper 90s to near 100. So we're looking at a decent weather evening for us. As we look at the forecast for tomorrow, temperatures are going to be back up into the lower 90s. So it does get hotter tomorrow. And you're going to start noticing the humidity creeping up as well as we make our way through the weekend. Looking at the future sky forecast, starting at 70 tomorrow morning. If you want to exercise outdoors, the morning time's the time to do it. And then we'll make our way into the lower to mid 90s by afternoon, even warmer than what we had today. Mid 90s on Sunday, even more humid. So it's going to feel like it's near 100 Sunday afternoon. On Monday, we're watching for a few, and I want to emphasize a few showers and thunderstorms in the forecast. I'm not expecting a whole lot, but that would be the only day in the next week where we have a chance of rain. As we look ahead, the high pressure system that this time of year usually brings us the sunshine and heat, it's going to be building in from the west slowly but surely next week, and that means temperatures start going even higher. So I really do hope you've had uh, an opportunity to enjoy the weather this week with highs in the 80s and those lows in the 60s because it's going away next week. We'll be in the upper 90s and probably pushing 100 by about a week from today. So here's a look at that seven-day forecast as you make your weekend plans. Maybe here to come to the stockyards or anywhere else in North Texas. Short sleeve weather. Make sure you're ready for a little bit more heat. We'll be in the mid-90s by Sunday for sure. Small chance of rain Monday and then we're off to the races upper 90s to even near 100 by Friday of next week. Let's go from the stockyards here in Texas to Oxnard, California. Check in with Bill Jones with a look at what's going on at Cowboys camp.